Station, Brett Favre, the star of the show today in Canton, where he's being inducted into the Hall of Fame tonight. And that's where we find sports director Charlie Sakaitis with a look at Favre ahead of the ceremony. In five years when Peyton Manning is inducted here at the Pro Football Hall of Fame, you can imagine a guy that's going to deliver a speech that is meticulously planned. It might even have an audible or two in there just in case one of his jokes doesn't land or his story isn't quite what he hoped. Brett Favre, on the other hand, not much of a planner. That's never really been his style. He's more of a go-by-your-gut guy. And tonight, when he takes the stage and the emotion grabs hold of him with the full weight of the moment, it's tough to know just how Brett will react, mostly because, for now, Favre himself doesn't know. Going through this in my mind a lot uh, as I've rehearse a speech in my mind and I'm not a person who has anything wrote down nor will I um, I I think I w my speech will be much like the way I play it, it'll be who in the hell knows <laughs> but I say that not to scare anyone that he's we may be here till three in the morning but it worked out fairly well for my career Though we don't know exactly what Favre is going to say when he does get up there and speak, we know he's going to mention a couple people specifically. Coming up later in sports, Marissa Silvis will talk about just who those people may be. For me, now live from the Pro Football Hall of Fame, keeping you connected, I'm Charlie Sakaitis, NBC 26.